Welcome to Tengsen Invest. We talk about investing, finance, a professional development. As the current time of 3:25 p.m. on the Eastern Time on June 28th on Tuesday, Ethereum contract at thousand one hundred fifty-six dollars. That about close to three percent so far. Respect to over crypto market and the equity market, we are sliding off. Um, you know, as we are trying to basically bounce, you know, up and down away from the bear market territory that we've been trying to get to. But the momentum has been relatively stale, right? Across the whole entire market, on the equity side, we are down respectively about two percent across all the indexes, while the VIX, which is the volatility index, is currently up about five percent so far. So it seems like the fear around the topic of you know recession uh, that we have heard from a lot of the economists and obviously public figure like Kathy Wood, for example, uh, depicting that the recession is already in. Um, driving negative pressure across the entire market, and for Ethereum specifically, is selling down from the previous level of substantiveness, which is twelve fifty, and now with the next level down, which is hundred dollars separation at eleven fifty. And this is very logical. This is something we've been talking about. So you know, and in, in addition to the news, we're basically about thirty minutes away from market closing. I do foresee us to be closing in the reds,、um, knowing the fact that with respect to the whole overall technicals, we are indicating more of a negative side of the of the spectrum versus more the positive side upstream type of spectrum, right? So let's just dive into the technical to see what's going on、uh, with respect to the current time of again three twenty seven p.m. on the Eastern Time. We are at eleven fifty,、uh, down three percent so far. And with respect to the current momentum, you can see that we are dipping down as we got cancelled out at the forty out of seventy. So ideally, heading down to the next level of support, technically at twenty six, means that we will we should technically break below a thousand, and then subsequently head down to the next level of support, which is nine fifty, all the way down to seven fifty, respectively. Bitcoin down two percent so far. Similar, right? You can see that clearly we are crossing down. So it's negative, negative, negative. So next level down should technically be somewhere around eighteen five hundred. Classic down five percent as well. You can see that clearly is negative, negative, and negative. So across the market is all negative.、Uh, selling down to the next level of support will be fifteen fifty. But you know that's not enough, right? You need to cross down and cross up. So retesting somewhere around where we tested before at thirteen fifty, all the way down to the next level of flat numbers at twelve fifty. Very logical. And then Dogecoin down six percent so far as six says at seven seven, right? Negative, 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 right? So coming down as we cross down would be somewhere around like the fifty, like the five cents level would be the logical level can like go back in,、uh, and instead of buying at the moment right now. Cardano, excuse me, down two point five percent so far at forty seven cents, right? With the thirty forty three right now, next level down is going to be somewhere around forty. Level down is gonna be thirty five,、um, at the forty seven cents at the moment right now. So level down will be somewhere around forty five, all the way down to forty, right? So I think the sell down back to forty cents is a lot more logical than going back up to the next level of fifty three cents. Um, Solana is down six percent so far at thirty six dollars. Um, you can see that we're in between levels, the levels of thirty eight versus thirty three, so we're in between. Is negative on the MACD, negative on the RSI, negative on the chart because we have a high propensity to go back down. So, just like something to prepare for. XRP down three point five percent at thirty four cents at the moment. So selling down back down to、uh, next level of support thirty eight on the RSI scale. Negative on the MACD front, we need to cross down, right? So selling down back to thirty cents would be more logical. Polkadot down three point eight five percent so far.、Uh, the level down would be somewhere around、um, like seven cents, right? And you can see that it's negative on the RSI, negative on the MACD. So selling down back to the level of about six twenty five or six dollars would be more logical.、Uh, Algorand down four percent so far at thirty one cents at the moment. Negative on the RSI, negative on the MACD side, so selling down back to somewhere around twenty-seven fifty. Very logical. Shiba Inu is at the cusp of breaking the thousand, which is very logical, right? With negative on the RSI, negative on the MACD side, you have a mega 
you know, separation into cross down for you to meet with this whole bar right here. So coming down to below around 850 all the way down to 700, you know, not not the most illogical from here. Uh, Polygon down 3.75%. Now we got to be meeting with the next level of support, basically 45 cents. All the way down to 35. We can see that clearly. Uh, right now, it's um, you need to cross down and then cross up, right? So this is uh, not looking so good, right? It's negative, negative, negative. So AVAX down 3% so far. Negative, 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 right? So selling down to $16, more logical. Okay, so seems like technical is coming true uh, as we speak us it makes sense right but obviously the media is um you know has a negative accelerance onto it right so um let me know how i can help you know and let me know if you have any questions feel free to reach out on the comment section below um and yeah so it seems like we're going to be in for more of a sell-off uh as, as we are consulting on the next level of support okay so appreciate you have a good rest of the day and take care